Kate and Dad, Patrick, and the three boys. What's your name here with the Caleb. ribbon? Caleb and Josiah. Josiah and my little guy here, Matthew. And so what happened today, gang? Who's going to tell me? What did you do today? Uh, I did the cross country race, and it was good. It was hard. It was hard. How far did you have to run? 3K. 3K. So you're a midget age? Uh, oh, younger. 12. 12, 12 year old. And uh, I see you got a medal in your hand. What's that medal for? Because uh, I won the race. Oh, can you put it on for me? Because <laughs> I won the race. Not only did you win, you had fun doing it, it looks like a big smile on your face. Turned around so we can see. So this is the BC Cross Country Championships. Wow. So you're the best in BC for 12 year olds at cross country. That's pretty amazing. Today. Today. Yeah. Today. Well, there's a good answer. On this course. On this course. In the rain. And why maybe? Because where do you live? Old River in the rain all the time. So this was a good course for you. You're kind of used to Except it. Except for the hills. Yeah. Except for the hills. Oh, okay. And so your little brother here, can you hold up your ribbon? And where did you come? Oh, you came seventh. Let's see that ribbon. There it is. And so how far did you have to run? 2K. 2K and you are 10? Yeah. And seventh place is the 10 year olds. So, do you want to be as good as your brother in two years? Yeah. Maybe and what? Better. Maybe better. Yeah. And how about little Matthew? Um, well, I got dragged around a lot and I had to watch my brother. Oh, yeah. I stand in the pouring rain. And you did it with a smile on your face. And well, you... not always. Yeah, not always. And so, what would your be your favorite sport to play or do? Um, triathlon. Oh, so you're already running, cycling, and biking? I mean, said biking, swimming? I know that. So who's your hero then? What? Oh, Simon Whitfield. Oh, I figured as much. Well, do you know what? You say that. Simon Whitfield used to come and win the BC Cross Country Championships. So yeah. So a good way to be a champion triathlete is to run cross country. So how about that? And can, can maybe, can you tell me about your mom? Did she ever run or did she like to do triathlon? Um, she's done one, I think. <laughs> Just one, you think? You don't even know. Do you know that I used to coach your mom in cross country? Oh, she told you that. So she's a pretty good runner. And how about dad? Well, I was only a good runner because I was chasing after my wife. Ah, well, you caught her, so you can't be that bad. Well, listen, it has been so great to have you all here. If you, I don't know if you know, but on November the 24th, so another month from now, probably in the pouring rain as well, at Jericho Beach in Vancouver, we're hosting the National Cross Country Championships. And you know who's going to be there running? A guy from Black Creek, British Columbia. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know his name? Do you know his name? Cam, Cam, have And you know what he did? He ran in the Olympic I know, we from Black Creek. Not well, only that, yeah. Yes. Yes. So we're going to be cheering for him and uh, at the National Championships they're going to be picking a team for the World Championships in Poland. And we're hoping Cam Levins will go there and run for Canada again. So maybe we'll see some of you there. But thank you so much to the Nye family for a great interview and a great day at the BC Cross Country Championships. Okay. You're welcome.